tutorial we will learn what is Ubuntu and how to use it. So this is the login screen of Ubuntu 12.04 LTS. LTS means long term support. So it will be supported for next five years, which means that it's valid for 2012 to 2017 in terms of the support which will be received from Canonical, which is the parent company of Ubuntu. Now let's log in into your login ID or user. So this is the username is being skilled and in the blank space in the text field, we will enter the password. In bottom, we can see there is Gus session, which means that it can be opened by any user. Um, the user can do any work they want. So be it is surfing, making documents, but once you log out from the guest, uh, guest session, the data will be removed. So in case you are using someone else's machine, please try to use guest session. And uh, if you want to save the data permanently on your hard drive, then, then always use the user account, not the guest session. So let's enter into the normal user, which is being skilled in this case. So now the screen will op open, which will be our desktop. So this is our Ubuntu desktop. So let's understand the UI first user interface. On the left side, there is launch pad, which has lots of shortcuts to different applications. And in following videos, we will explore each of them. On the, on the top side, there is this bar, which contains the user ID which is used for switching into other accounts. So in case there are, in this case, we have one single user and one cached session. But if you have multiple accounts, then you will see whole list over here. Besides that, we have time and this mini calendar. So we can see the time and then we can see the date, the year. We can also change the settings of time and date. We will do that afterwards. Then there is this music control by which we can increase or decrease the music, the volume of the music. The rhythm box is the default music player. So if you will click on this, then the rhythm box will open and will start playing uh, music from the current playlist. Then this is for internet or network. So in, in case, these double sided arrows are not coming then there is some problem with the network else the network is working so in case you can see these kind of arrows the network is working also this shows the status of the battery in this case it will take 24 minutes to charge and this is valid for uh, laptops because in PCs you get consistent power supply this is for IM instant manager instant man messenger so in case you have configured one then you will see the status and you will uh, you will get updates as well this is for the, on the top right side if you click on this really then it, it will show you system settings displays startup applications then we have lock screen so in case you are going out or going uh, going away from your computer a lock screen do lock screen uh, for ensuring that no other user can access your user account without your permission or without knowing your password log out for is for when you have when you have signed in into any account and you want to log out then click on log out if you want to shut down the machine then click on shut down and we will explore these short uh, these available menus in following videos so in the next video we will explore what is what is dash home and how to use it thank you for watching the video